Hey, what's going on there guys? Welcome back to another episode of Kingdom Hearts Unchained X. My name is Jonathan Snow, and today guys, I'm actually happy to say that we're going to do a new weekly series. It's probably going to be called Weekly Update, and today is April 29th, 2016. As you guys can see, it's like 3.33 in the morning. Uh, we just got the April update, and let's take a look at exactly what we got. And it says, New Metals and Skills to Thrive. So first things first, you gotta say, wow, look, we finally have new medals. It seems like every week or every reset, because every week they, they're, they're doing an update. So we're getting new medals every week. So definitely save your jewels for that. Um, you can see we have a, a new Leon, which is a, a, a strength. Um, then we have new Aerith. We have a brand new Genie, which is awesome. I love the Genie. Um, we have Daisy Duck, we have, I don't know his name, The Clock the, for the Rabbit, and um, that's Phil, I believe his name is. So, here we go, it says, New Metals, I'm Aerith, the Flower Girl, nice to meet you. I would do a girl's voice, but it's too early right now, so. <laughs> Who better to welcome spring showers and blooming flowers than Aerith? She brought some of her friends, familiar faces, w with her as well. Starting today, you'll have a chance to get these medals in the shop. So let's go ahead and let's just discuss on what the medals do. We have fill, power attribute, two cost, single target, increased power base strength by one tier for one turn. So that's pretty much like another Diz, because I think Diz does the same thing. Uh, White Rabbit, speed, um, two cost, single target, increased speed, base strength by one turn, one tier, one turn. So it's another like increase, um, increase buff. But it's for um, the speed medals. Um, I forgot who has that. I think uh, this this kid. Um, he's from Kingdom Hearts 2. Uh, I'll show you guys what I'm talking about later on. Um, we have Kingdom Hearts Aerith. Magic. Because we do have another Aerith. And she's speed. So it's cool that there's another magic um, Aerith out there. Increase magic base strength by one tier for one turn. So another buff card. Uh, Kingdom Hearts 2 Leon version B. So we do have a blue Leon. So now we have a, a, a version 2. Um, this time he only does a single hit because the blue one actually does a multi-hit, if you guys didn't know that. Um, 2 gauge, single target, inflicts more damage the higher your HP. That's pretty interesting. I wouldn't mind tech, uh, checking that out because my HP I think is like around 5,000 or so. So I wonder if, uh, obviously it says the higher your HP, the more damage it does, but I want to see how that scales. Uh, we have Daisy, um, Speed. She's brand new, um, a two cost, single target, um, recovers HP before attacking, moderately recovers HP before attacking. That's not too bad, she's like Tinkerbell, um, but she's for speed, I don't think there's any speed heal cards, if I'm not mistaken, I'm not too sure about that, but I think she's the first um, heal, because mostly they're for blue, so now there's finally speed. So now, now we also have um, Genie, he's the highest cost so far out of all the medals, three cost, he hits everybody. Inflicts more damage to paralyzed targets, which is pretty cool because if you do have paralyzed, um, you know, ability, that'll become, um, that's a good thing. <laughs> and then we have a new skills to thrill, um, uh, campaign, stand against the heartless with new powerful medals, skill to thrill, um, not, not only including five star medals, you'll also get one of the skills below, but, oh, that's pretty cool, so, not only that you guarantee a five star medal, but you actually guarantee the skills sleep, paralyzed, poison, attack boost. Um, attack boost, attack boost, or oh, the attack boost, defense boost, attack boost times two, and then the new, the brand new um, Lux Plus increased Lux drop rate for enemies. That's not bad, that's pretty cool. I'm glad they actually introducing this, so this gives you a little bit more incentive to get the 3000 deal. But I won't do that because there's actually another deal that I want to check out. Um, there is also a new quest called VIP Skill Quest, and this is a limited time only. Max out your skill level. It starts today and ends May May eighth. If you have new medals with with skills you want to level up, this event has been waiting for you during this campaign. A set um, a set of special VIP skill quests. Will include the uh, quest to unlock the weekly jewel extravaganza. So basically, when you're paying the fifteen dollars, you'll actually get this quest. If you want to transfer a useful skill from one metal to another, take this opportunity to max out the skill 
and 100% transfer rate, which is cool because if you know that if you try to fuse one metal with another metal, there's actually a percentage that that skill may not get transferred over. So this, I'm assuming this event will get you that guaranteed. So we're going to check out this more in detail in another video. It's going to be a separate video. I just want to show you guys this actually does exist. And I think that's pretty much it for today's update. But what we're going to do is we're going to check the store now. If you guys are still with me here. And we're going to go to shop. Because there's actually something new here which is called. If you see we usually have the daily deal for 600 jewels. But now we have a thing called small deal. So you get uh, you get a one three star medal for 300 jewels. Is it worth it? To me not really because it's. It's okay, I guess, if you don't want to waste the, the other 300 jewels. Because if you think about it, when you when you log in every day for five days, you get about 500 jewels. So, you know, it's it's kind of feasible. But should we do it? Um, I'm just gonna do it this one time for this, just for the video. So let's just go ahead and see um, what small deal jewel we get. So here we go, guys. We're gonna do it just this one time because neither though I don't think it's gonna be kind of worth it, but. Let's see what we get. You never know. We may get a new medal here. So here we go. And we have Minnie Mouse, which is not bad because she's my second one. That's pretty cool. So I'm not I'm not too too sad about that. So and it's cool because you actually can continue doing that. There's no limit on that. So like the daily deal, there is a limit. So let's go ahead and get one daily deal as well. Because every day I would like to try to get a daily deal. Let's see if we get some of the new medals here. So here we go. First time, first time. All right. Looks like we get a four star. And okay, so we get a, a five star stitch, which is not bad because now I can actually try to guilt mine to even uh, 25%. We, we have a Dumbo, and then we have a Yuffie, and which I think I have both of them. I have all three of them anyway. So no new cards or no new medals, unfortunately. But let me know down in the comments below, guys, if you want to see this every Friday. Um, I would definitely be willing to do that for you guys So yeah, that'll be it guys for today's um weekly update and uh, Let me know if you guys are excited for these new medals because I'm definitely am I'm trying to hope to get Leon and maybe the genie because genie is one of my favorite characters in Disney, so uh, Let me know guys See you guys later. Peace out